Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to tell you about five weird Danish laws they have over here. Stay tuned to see if you've heard about any of them. So the first one is it is illegal for a woman to step onto any form of transport, public transport over here in Denmark, with a hat nail longer than 15 centimeters. Now, if you don't know what a hat nail is, it's kind of like a, a brooch that you would wear in your hat. And it's, I think, something more that you would do in like the 1920s, 30s. So I assume it's not so much of a problem these days, but it is highly illegal, so don't do it. So obviously Denmark is a, a country that has loads of bikes, lots of cyclists. And because of all this, this bike traffic, oftentimes the police will sit to the side of the, like the bike lanes and kind of they'll watch out if you don't have um, a working light or your brakes aren't working or you don't have the right um, like up to code gears or brakes, things like that. So like anything wrong with your bike. But what people might not know is that the police can actually also fine you if you don't lock your bike. So according to the traffic act over here, if you leave your bike unlocked anywhere, you can actually incur a fine of 500 kroner. This next one is a little bit tongue in cheek. And if you're Swedish, I'm going to say <laughs> right up front, I'm sorry. Um, but basically this law stems all the way back from the 1600s. Um, there was a war between Sweden and Denmark. Um, there was this one night in the middle of winter where the basically the body of water between Denmark and Sweden froze over and the Swedes launched a surprise attack against Denmark where they ran across the ice and just yeah started a war with Denmark. Um, after that war, a law was passed over here in Denmark that it is legal to beat a Swede with a stick, if you see him. Um, and technically that law is still in effect today. Uh, I'm sure if you like don't actually do that because I'm sure newer laws have kind of like overridden, you know, like don't assault people, don't beat people. Um, I'm sure those laws would take precedence over this old law, but technically that old law is still in effect. So in Denmark, it is legal to beat a Swede with a stick. The next law over here in Denmark is that it is illegal for you, a regular citizen, to launch a rocket into space. Um, and failure to comply, if you actually do launch a rocket into outer space, it can actually lead up to two years in prison. Um, the thinking behind this is, I think they just don't want like debris and injuries stemming from failed rocket launches, things like that. Um, so if you've been thinking about building and shooting off a rocket, don't do it because it's not worth the two years in prison. The next one is that over here in Denmark, it's technically not illegal to escape from prison in that you, if you escape from prison and you get caught, you get returned, no additional time will actually be added onto your sentence like it might do in other countries. So if you're in prison in Denmark, what have you got to lose? May as well try it. And I'm gonna throw in a little bonus one. So this is the unofficial number six, if you will. Um, if you are not a Danish citizen or you are a resident of under two years, so you've lived here in Denmark less than two years, it is actually legal for you to collect things from beaches and the in Danish waters here. This is again an older law, I think it comes from like the end of the 1895 or so, end of the 1800s, um, where people would comb beaches for scrap wood, you know, for if like a fishing boat had crashed and washed ashore. Um, People would salvage things from along the beach or in like the shallow waters and then sell it for a profit. Um, so that's where this law comes from. So if you're not a Danish citizen, don't be picking stuff up from the beach and definitely don't think about selling it. Thanks so much for watching. This is just a fun little video of little tidbits, history tidbits that I found out about. If you're Danish and if you know about any other little silly or weird laws that you have over here in Denmark, either officially or unofficially, uh, let me know down in the comments. And if you're not from here, maybe let me know some of the, the weird laws that you have in your own country. Thanks again for watching. See you next time.